Duolingo's updated look looks horrible. And I had already finished all the stories and I liked going back to them, but I guess they're really, really good for XP farming. But like, I, I had all this, I had everything unlocked to, to level one. And I kind of miss the like level zero, level one. And I kind of missed that. There was some cool glitch that you could do with the classes to, to make you like unlock everything they recently fixed that I loved. Now I can't do gotta go. Now I can't do gotta go. Uh, and now I can get it to freaking five. I had it at like three and I was just bouncing all over the place. I miss bouncing all over the place. I might just keep on testing this and testing this until until I jump to it. I probably will. This is stupid though. I guess it's it's an okay solution to people like gaming the leaderboards so. though. Because those kind of people are really annoying. Yeah. <clears throat> Yeah, go have, um, yeah, uh, do it legitly and have someone who did the same story 500 times be, like, number one in the league. Yeah, that's actually pretty stupid. I think this is an okay, I think this is, this is an okay solution to this. kind of like the old way better but I mean not quite sure yet I debatably kind of like the new one a little bit too though Okay, I think I'll just keep on trying to test out of this until I pass, and then I'll unlock more content. The the exploit with the classrooms to unlock everything, almost everything, doesn't work anymore, sadly. <clears throat> 